congratulations on the win, but you think you were a bit fortunate in the overall balance of the game? It was a tough game, and I have never. The start is always difficult in the season. I think for for every team. And yeah, today I think we can be much better on the ball. We have proven um, in the uh, last season and also in pre-season. But there uh, you see, pre-season is not season. Eh? When the league starts, opponents are more aggressive. And that we have seen from moves, uh, they were very aggressive. I think we were in. Uh, uh, our skills, we could be better in decision making and then when we were in the battle we were not aggressive enough. So from that point of view we can do a lot of things better but also I see uh, many positive things from this that we had I think five, six, seven good and high ball regains and then we have to take more from the turnovers and in the end you know, in a low block uh, we, f we fought for our lives and we survived it. So. Three points, well done. Sorry, you you did lose your first two games last season. So, how important is the victory, no matter how it was achieved? Ah, but you have seen, even when you lose them, you can still finish good in the, in, in the league. So, uh, yeah, you have to find a foundation in the season, and therefore you have to collect points. But yeah, uh, if you want to keep collecting points, we have to play better as we did today. But as I say, there were also positives. Uh, it's a defending organization, uh, the clean sheet, which is good, and uh, the mentality, uh, keep going and keep believing in a win. And um, yeah, we found a way to win. Thank you. Boy, Eric, how goes it? How goes it? For me it goes well, with you. Uh, I want to talk to you about the defensive transition you've spoken about. You said you want United to be the best transition team in the world. And you want to talk about the speed going forward. But in terms of what you're looking when you want to transition back, what exactly is the thing that you keep telling your players? Well, first of all, we have to um, yeah, move with the ball and to be compact. And then once we are compact, and then you have to be uh, aggressive. Uh, to be the fight in, in the duels and so on that prospect uh, today we've, uh, we we lost some fights and then yeah, counter attacks uh, you have to uh, you allow the opponent counter attacks but yeah um, luckily uh, we were we defend the counter attacks as well or we had Andre Onana we had some very good saves yeah. uh, what were your thoughts on Mason Mount's performance today I think he did he did his job uh, it was um, when moderate came, and um, I think he did. So he did. He did well. So, uh, Eric, obviously, you started without a recognisable striker. You, you didn't lose Anthony Marshall. The goals come from a defender. Are you worried at all that there's maybe a lack of preparation where you've not got that recognisable striker, and, and it was another game where goals were hard to come by? I think we, we could have scored. Uh, I had touched on uh, the, the five, six turnovers, and there were overloads, but uh, I think um, uh, the, the front line was not in the best form today, and they could have uh, made more out of it uh, from the overload situations. And uh, last week, we scored some incredible goals. Uh, this week, man, this is the form of the day. We didn't, but it will come. Uh, can I just ask what you thought of the, the penalty or the non-penalty at the end? That it looked for a minute like the referee was coming over to look at the screen. Were you worried at all that they are given that? Oh, it can always be happen. <laughs> that when, so uh, when uh, VAR looked at it and they decided not to give, and of course we are pleased with it. Uh, last question. But did you feel it? You didn't feel it was a penalty. Gary O'Neill has said that Onana tried to take his player's head off. Yeah, but, uh, I don't feel that I have to react on his interpretation. So you, you didn't think it was a penalty? Yeah, it's about the, the referee eh, and the VR. And so I think the two players from, from the rules, they come together. Eh, and, and Andre didn't interfere the action from both of them. First was a touch on the ball, I think from Dawson. And then what eh, came Andre. Thank you very much.